today we are going to discuss a t test problem so the average breaking strength of the steel rods is specified to be 18.5000 pounds average means mean has given okay mean is 18.5 okay so next x bar is 17.85 to test the sample of 14 rods, n value is equal to 14, n value 14 has given the mean and standard deviation, mean is 17.85 and standard deviation is 1.955. Okay, now is the result of the experiment significant or not? So consider the, you have to use the t test because 14 that is nothing but the Sample size is n is equal to 14, which is less than 30. We have to use the t test. So H0 we consider as the mu is equal to 18.5, H1 mu not equal to 18.5, that is a two tail test. And level of significance always you have to consider it as 5%, that is default. If we didn't give anything, level of significance. And the test statistic is formula t is equal to x bar minus mu based standard deviation by root n minus 1 that is x bar is 17.85 mu is 18.5 s is 1.955 root n minus 1 14 minus 1 simplify that one you are going to get 1.99 that is nothing but calculated t value is 1.99 tabulated t for 5 percent level of significance that is nothing but two tail test that is nothing but 0 0.025 level of significance that means 0 5 percent is 0 0.05 two tail test that's why you divide with two therefore you are going to get test 0 0.025 and the degree of freedom is n minus one that is 14 minus one n is 14 therefore 14 minus one 13 for 13 degree of freedom for 0 0.025 level of significance the tabulated t value is 2.16 therefore calculated t is 1.99 and tabulated t is 2.16 and the calculated to where t is less than tabulated t therefore h naught is accepted okay that means this uh, to test this sample of 14 dots are tested the mean and standard respectively is the result of experiment significant okay therefore h naught you can say that t is accepted okay thank you